here I am showing division by 10, 100 and 1000. Suppose you are dividing 24 by 10. So here the 4, here is 1 0. So from the right side this 4 is remainder. This 4 is remainder. So and the rest is the, the rest digit from the quotient. So 2 is the quotient q equal to quotient and 4 is the remainder. If you perform the actual division then you find like this 10 10 to the 20 after subtracting you are getting 4. So 2 is the quotient and 4 is the remainder. Ok. Suppose uh, I perform the second division by 100 300 uh, 346 by 100. Here is two digit. So the right from the two digit this form the remainder. This two digit form the remainder and this is become quotient. So Q equal to 3 and R equal to 46. Clear? Another see another example 300 3462 divided by 1000. Right? So here is three digit three, uh, three digit from the right side one two three. This is the remainder and this one is the percent. So percent equal to three and remainder equal to four hundred sixty two. Isn't it easy? You can perform actual division as you like. Okay. See this example. I am actually dividing this dividend by 10. 10 3 is a 30 minus 6. I take down 4. 10 6 is a 60. After subtracting, I am getting 4. Again 6. 10 4 is a 40. 40, right? 6. I am take down here 5. 10 6 is a 60 I got 5 5 as the remainder because no more division can be performed because there is no digit after 5 and now this remainder is less than 10 always notice that when division will end at the con when con what is the condition when you stop the division the condition is that condition is that remainder equal to 0 or remainder is less than divisor okay but remainder huh? okay now in shortcut way what I taught you in uh, earlier phases here 3 6 4 6 divided by 10 here is 1 0 then this one digit from right is remainder and rest all is quotient Okay, 3, 6, 4, 6. Here is 3, 6, 4, 6, 5 here. Sorry, 5 is the remainder and this all is the quotient. Right? Again, I am erasing this one because it is not clear. Again, I am writing this one here. 3, 6, 4, 6, 5 divided by 10. So, here is 1, 0. So, this remainder extreme rightmost digit is the remainder and rest one is the quotient okay you notice here 3 6 4 6 is the quotient and 5 is the remainder okay